Hello everyone. I want to tell you the story of an ordinary centurion named Maximus, a warrior whose legion defended the interests of Rome in the lands of the barbarians. When Gaius Julius Caesar traveled to the lands of the Britons, the field camp of the 12th legion was attacked by a horde of Gauls, and only the bravery of the legionnaires could stop them. The barbarian horde has built a battering ram and ladders and under the cover of archers preparing. To storm, legionaries took their places on the walls and near the gates and are ready to fight. To the last soldier, Centurion Maximus sent a messenger to Julius Caesar for help, but the barbarian scouts caught him and executed him. The Gauls have decided to kick Rome out of their land once and for all. Well, let's see if they succeed or not. Maximus decided to climb the walls and look at the enemy's assault. He noticed that the ballista was missing a man, so he took the place of the Onagra gunner. Maximus started destroying the enemies with dozens of catapults on the approach to the camp. The enemy didn't expect this. While the barbarians were taking casualties on the left flank from the catapult's fire, the barbarians with the battering ram were closing in on the gate, and Maximus moved his fire to the battering ram. He knew he had only a few minutes before the ram would be out of range of the ballista, but he kept hoping for pots of earth and oil to ignite the ram and keep the barbarians from entering the camp. Hooray, the ram is destroyed. Now we can throw one more pot to say goodbye and we must run to the left flank. There the enemy is already climbing the walls. We will throw on them everything we have. The barbarians will be sorry they decided to attack us. For the Senate and the people of Rome, attack.
The enemy under the walls is dying by the hundreds. They did not expect such a response from the Romans. But Maximus heard shouts from the courtyard. It seems the enemy is breaking through. It's time to dip his sword in the blood of the barbarians and show a personal example of bravery. The enemy broke through the walls, but timely command Centurion corrected the situation. Judging by the cries of pain, barbarians are starting to lose. Let us conquer to the end.
Hurrah, the enemy is slaughtered and has taken heavy casualties for Rome. But the battle is not over. The enemy has retreated and is waiting for reinforcements in the form of the army of the Dacians. Centurion must survive and not shame Aquila. Well, what will happen next you will see in the next episode. Thank you very much for your attention and please support the channel by subscribing.